next one, Martin Belt's back again with a brand new video. This is going to be a detailed look at a real leather WWE Championship replica belt. This is done in the 2018 leather style and features the removable AJ Styles side discs. So yeah, let's just get into this. Um, as I said, this is the 2018 styling, so it's the Wildcat styled leather, as you can see on the end of the belt there, crafted by Paul Martin to certify its authenticity. A two by seven snap box here, gold snaps of course, with the Wildcat tooling. So really a big fan of this 2018 styling. Uh, the previous versions of this belt had a little bit different leather, same with the Universal belt, but I think this is my favorite version that has actually been on this belt on TV. Uh, so of course we've got the cross hatch tooling here with the background tooled area here. Of course we've got the camouflage tooling going all around the plates top and bottom so you can really see a nice shine off of them, really nice glossy straps, leather popping really nicely. So like I said that goes all the way around to the other side of the side plate. The tooling behind the main plate is probably the most obvious difference in the 2018 version, uh, especially on TV. You do see this kind of popping a lot. Uh, it's a bigger tool used than the old ones. The previous tooling behind actually used to be a lot like what is in the crosshatch areas and it was behind here, so it didn't actually pop as much. As you can see, it catches the light quite nicely, but this really, being a bigger tool, you, you see it more. So if you've seen it on TV and you see the detail behind it looking a lot, more prominent, that is the 2018 version by Wildcat, so that's similar to this tooling. Looks really nice. Like that, of course the nice red swoosh on this belt, the Universal having the black one. So it's a nice pop from the strap there. Uh, like I said, the cross hatch tooling over here. Uh, this is what was behind the logo on the older versions of this belt, 2016-17. And of course we move on to the 2x5 snap box here again, the Wildcat tooling, gold tip. Really nice looking uh, design on this, I really enjoy doing these. Uh, we'll move over to the back, of course it has the black leather backing with the side discs exposed there so these can be removed and changed. So maybe when AJ Styles eventually loses the belt, if ever, uh, you can change these over for someone else. And of course we have the 2x5 snaps exposed there. On the other side, of course, we cover them up because there's no need to show those, but you can see through the leather the indentation of them. And of course, the screws, other than the side disc ones, are all covered up really nicely with the real leather. So yeah, that's about what all there is to show of this belt. I think that's given a decent overview. If you're interested in one of these, I also do offer these as a send-out strap option. So this is what, the, yeah, I offered a send out strap option. So this is what would arrive. It's the exact same tooling style, exact same specifications. The only difference is the holes are punched all the way through to the back. So all you'd need to do is attach your, your plates to it and that would be it. Uh, the tip holes are also punched for that to be attached. The snaps are of course all included as well. So the only difference is, whereas this has covered bolts, this would have them all exposed. So if you're interested in one of these send out straps, please contact me at my email in the description box below or check out my website. They will be listed on there. So yeah, thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Let me know, uh, what version of this belt has been your favorite? And by that, I mean, was it this, the network logo, or was it the scratch logo that was introduced by The Rock? So. This version was introduced by Brock Lesnar, and then, of course, the Scratch logo was introduced by The Rock. So which version do you prefer? I personally prefer this version. I think the big, thick red swoosh on this one really lets it pop a lot nicer, and that previous one had a big banner saying Champion, which I wasn't a huge fan of. But I know a lot of people did actually prefer that belt, so let me know in the comment section down below. I'm curious to hear the opinion on between these two. Like I said, thanks very much for watching. Goodbye.